Well, we are on some old school shit right now. Yeah, so right now we actually are playing Call of Duty 4. Some of you guys may be wondering, well, why are you playing COD 4? Well, since Infinite Warfare is, if you think about it, it's right around the corner, it's a couple months away, why not just play some COD 4 because COD 4 Remastered? I've heard some people say that they think that like, oh, COD 4 Remastered is going to have like, gonna have like a new campaign, it's gonna have like more multiplayer maps, more everything. To be honest guys, COD 4 Remastered is not going to be that. You know what Black Ops 1 is, right? You know how that's available on the Xbox One now. It's not an Xbox One game, but you can put an Xbox 360 game of it in. It's going to be the same thing. It's going to be the same COD 4 with updated graphics. That's all it's going to be. But I'm just very happy I was able to find a lobby. Do you know how long it took me to find this lobby? I think I was waiting here for like 30 minutes to find a lobby. This game is like deserted now. Like it only has like a thousand players online. A lot of people's first COD was COD 4 just because it was like the first COD that was like revolutionary that came out. It was the first like quick scoping COD, the first sniping COD, the first trick shotting COD. And a lot of people's first COD was COD 4. COD 4 is really not that bad of a game at all, and I actually can't wait for it to be remastered. When I was going back to talking about it being remastered, all it's going to be is updated graphics. Don't expect anything like special about the game, like, oh, they're gonna add new multiplayer weapons, and there's gonna be like DLC maps. Don't go around and thinking that. It's not like it's the new game coming out. Like, no, all it's gonna be is like better graphics. Like, if you think about if MW3 was remastered, all it would be was better graphics. They wouldn't be adding anything special. There wouldn't be any special DLC or anything. It would just be updated graphics. The only problem is I have not pre-ordered Infinite Warfare yet. Usually me, when there's a new COD coming out, I pre-order that when the day it's like able to be pre-ordered. Not this one though. The only reason is, is I have to pre-order three games. I have to pre-order three. You may be asking, well, I know about Infinite Warfare. What are the other two? Well, I'm gonna pre-order Battlefield 1 because honestly it looks amazing and that would be something really cool to do on my let's play channel and it it looks like a really fun game so i'm just gonna pre-order it the other game that i have to pre-order is mafia 3 you guys did not know mafia 3 is actually coming out next month and i need to pre-order that shit you guys don't know mafia 2 is my favorite game of all time i know how i always talk about that like like, Black Ops 2 is my favorite COD of all time, and, like, Modern Warfare 3 is really close to that. Mafia 2 is easily my favorite game of all time. Mafia 2 had great DLC packs. Mafia 2 had great single player. Mafia 2 is very realistic. It really did symbolize what times were like back then. And Mafia 3 looks beautiful. It looks like Mafia 2 with better graphics, better guns, and better cars. And I am so, so so excited to play it and honestly for all three of those games maybe only two of them I'm maybe not infinite warfare just because this channel is a cod channel so if i'm playing infinite warfare it's probably going to go on this channel and if i'm playing cod 4 remastered it's going to go on this channel but those two final games i talked about battlefield 1 and mafia 3 those are all going to be on my let's play channel that's really going to wrap it up for this video i hope you guys did enjoy seeing me play some old shit even though that i kind of did pretty bad but i mean it was fun but yeah guys it's been freeze here i'll see you on my next video later